first swarm of 2024 here in northern West Virginia. I'm going to attempt to get this thing off this gas well or meter. This is in my brother's yard. And I was standing here in the garage and I seen these things fly in and they lit here on this gas meter. But uh, they come from down the creek that way there. So uh, I don't know. It, it's a halfway decent swarm, but I'm going to put it in this here nuke box. I will uh, turn you back on when I get them in there. What I'm going to do, I'm going to take these frames and let them things crawl on there and I'll try to get them in that box like that. I'm going to get in here and check this split out here that I made here a couple of weeks ago. I just want to see if there's a queen in there. I know she probably hadn't been mated yet, but uh, I did put some cells in here. So <coughs> I'm going to check this out here. And that split come from that hive right out there. So I'm just putting a little video out here for y'all to watch well i see my diatomaceous earth has worked i had uh them big black wood ants or whatever you call them carpenter ants they were in my uh cover here and i put some diatomaceous earth in here and i don't have no ants in there now so I'm going to get in here and check. i seen some pollen coming in here, so uh, I know that I've probably got a queen in here, a virgin queen. I hope I didn't take a queen out of that hive and put in here, but I couldn't, I couldn't find her the other day when I was uh, doing this. Well, I just checked that hive out. I had to add another uh, box to it. They were getting it full of... Uh, nectar but uh i've got a virgin queen in there but i've got plenty of bees in there so i'm i'm gonna let them fill that up but i did see her in there so i didn't take old queen out of the hive up there so i'll let them build up and i will check them a little bit later if uh they go getting too full, I'll take them out of there and put them in a 10 frame box or move them on the side of my long hive up there where I don't have nothing in it. I'll move it up there. So uh, we'll just let them do what they're going to do right here. And if they build up good, then maybe I'll move them up on that side of my long hive. So Right here it is. I didn't have my tripod here tonight to, to get this. So this is what you're going to get. I'll take you down here and show you. We'll go see if uh, swarms uh, settling in down here at my dad's place. Swarm number two of the year. And this was caught on the building out here from my house. But right there you can see them. They're bringing pollen in and we've got a swarm in here. So this is swarm number two of 2024. Well, Right here, got swarm number three of 2024 here in West Virginia. And uh, I've 
I've got swarm number two over home. I'll, I'll show you it when I get back over home there. And this is May the 4th. Well, right here, it's the fourth swarm of the year. I caught these bees right up here out from my dad's house. And his house is right down there. But this is the fourth swarm of 2024. I'm up here after work tonight. I wanted you all to see this. This is a hive that I split out here. And that may be on the beginning of this video. This video has been, been put together now for a couple of weeks. And this hive here, it's got a new queen in here. And uh, I just wanted you all to see this. But this is a split from my hive out around here. And I'll walk you over there and show you this one. But that hive back there was a split out of this hive right here. So uh, you can see how these bees are working. But I just want you all to see this. Uh, Actually, you've seen the swarms that I've caught so far. I'm up here tonight uh, checking my swarm traps after work, see if I caught anything else, but I haven't so far. So uh, I just wanted you all to see this. But the hive, it's right back out around here in that box right out there is a sister hive to this one here behind me so i'm going to end this video here i went up and i checked my bucket swarm trap there wasn't nothing in it so i'm going to end this video i hope you all enjoyed the video and i will be getting some more stuff out here in the near future uh like i said i'm uh, working on a another long beehive so i will be bringing that to you here a little bit later that will be a future video but uh i've got to get these swarms moved into hives and i will take you all along on that but i hope you all enjoyed the video and i will see you all on the next one and may the good lord bless you all and whatever you are doing tonight i will see you all on the next one